Now to Oshkosh, where your Oshkosh neighborhood reporter Seth Humanick reports from a prison today to meet some four-legged friends who are in training to help people on the outside and are already helping inmates. Oshkosh Correctional Institution has over 2,000 inmates, but 43 of them have a special job. They train and care for the institution's 13 future service dogs, who officials hope will someday make a big difference, but inmates say are already making their lives better. I'll tell you, this has been a fantastic. When I came here, I mean, I, was, I myself had a lot of anxiety, so having the dog that helped me. John Lee is an inmate at Oshkosh Correctional and is part of the team that helps care for the dogs during their life inside the prison. In addition to helping his anxiety, he says working in the dog program has taught him teamwork and patience, skills he hopes to use to give back when he's released. When I get out, I like to just volunteer, you know, working in a dog shelter or help train the dogs or use some of the skills that I learned here. Journey Together Service Dog runs the program. It teaches inmates how to train the dogs and ultimately delivers the dogs to clients. Journey Together President Pam Schubert says inmates help train the dogs for a variety of roles, but the dogs primarily help people suffering from PTSD. The more that we can help them get back to going out in public, going to the store or going to busy places, Places, the better life that they're going to have. If we can help one person have a better life, that's what we do it all for. Jeremy Wondercheck says he's serving time for robbery and has been helping care for and train dogs like Dream for just shy of a year. He says he hopes his involvement in the program will help make up for his past. It really makes, makes me feel good personally, uh, knowing that I'm doing something to pay back some of the wrong that I've done. Wondercheck says he's seen service dogs make a big difference for people like his nephew, who lives with autism, and says he's glad to know his work could make people's lives better. We're being given an amazing opportunity to help someone, uh, and I don't think any of us take that very lightly. Just because we've made mistakes doesn't mean we can't be better in the future and doesn't mean we can't uh, help create things that are great and better for other people. In Oshkosh, Seth Humanick, NBC. 26.